Instagram and NFTs are finally here. So Adam Mozeri, Instagram's CEO, just posted a reel about an hour ago that uh, Instagram will now be diving into the NFT space. You know it was bound to happen. Mark Zuckerberg is constantly evolving and changing and going deeper and deeper into the metaverse and NFTs and crypto. So now they're starting to roll it out into the community. So let's check out exactly what Adam had to say about the NFTs and what programs they're rolling out to bring NFTs and Instagram together. The creator economy is incredibly important to Instagram. Creators are incredibly important to Instagram, but one of the challenging things that we need to solve as an industry is how to help creators make a living doing what they love. For sure. Uh, as you may know, creators is a full-time occupation nowadays. So the more Instagram can pay their creators, the more users they're going to get, the longer people are going to stay on the platform, the more money Instagram makes. Right now, there are a number of different ways for creators to make money, but a lot of them are unpredictable and changing rapidly. Now, we think one really interesting opportunity for a subset of creators is NFTs, the idea of owning a unique digital item. So what we're starting with this week is the ability for creators and people to share NFTs that they've made or that they bought, either in feed or in stories or in messaging. So it sounds like basically all you can do right now is if you have an NFT, you can post it and then they'll have like a separate tag. So for a business owner, you can tag products or if you uh, have a picture with your friends, you can tag your friends. So I guess they're gonna come out with a little tag that says, oh, I own this board Ape or I own this CryptoPunk. Think, right? We don't know, they just launched this an hour ago. It's a limited number of people to start and there's a lot more functionality that we're gonna need to build over time, but we wanted to start small and learn from the community. Now I wanna acknowledge up front that NFTs and blockchain technologies and Web3 more broadly are all about distributing trust, distributing power. But Instagram is fundamentally a centralized platform. So there's a tension there. So one of the reasons why we're starting small is we want to make sure that we can learn from the community. We want to make sure that we work out how to embrace those tenets of distributed trust and distributed power. Right, they can't just go out and fully implement a buy and sell NFTs or something along those natures where you can buy and sell crypto on Instagram. I'm sure one day they're going to have that, but they need to roll these changes out very slowly so they can test, see what works, see what doesn't. I see this in the ad space. Facebook constantly gives you tests to run. They use test dummies. They give you ad credits because they need to roll out these features slowly to make sure they're ready for the masses. Despite the fact that we are, yes, a centralized platform. We do think one of the unique opportunities we have is to make Web3 technologies accessible to a much broader range of people. And NFT specifically, we think will be interesting not only to creators who create NFT. So see, that's pretty cool. They basically have what NFT it is, what number it is out of the lot. So it just gives you some information. And I guess the tag is gonna be, it's a digital collectible. So that's pretty cool, right? I think it'll bring more authenticity to each NFT project. It'll bring a little bit more transparency to the space and a little bit more knowledge. I think this will bring a wider acceptance into the NFT space. So this could be a really cool thing. As Instagram starts to roll this out, the wider public will be more accepted of NFTs. The art, but also to people who wanna collect it. So keep an eye out, let us know what you think, let us know what you wanna see next. And you're gonna be hearing a lot more from us on not only NFTs, but on how to better support creators' ability to make a living over the next couple months. See you next week. Peace. So I really like how he ended that. They're really looking to support their creators. Why do creators do so well on YouTube? Because YouTube ad revenue pays extremely well. So what Instagram is trying to do, just like TikTok did, they're paying their creators. They're looking for the people who are making content on the platform to pay them well so they keep on creating more content how they're gonna do this with NFTs. Maybe you can even create NFTs through Instagram. Maybe the pictures you post will become NFTs. I don't know, but just know this, Facebook, Meta, Instagram, Adam, Mark Zuckerberg, they're gonna constantly keep evolving. They did it with Snapchat and Stories. They did it with Vine and Video. They did it with TikTok and Reels. Um, so I think Meta, Facebook, Instagram, they are going to be the winning platform long term. So yeah, that's some just quick news on NFTs and Instagram. They finally did it. What do you think is gonna happen next? Do you think this is gonna work? Do you think you can buy and sell NFTs on Instagram? Comment below and let me know. I'll see you guys on the next one. Peace.